Today I am going to give you 12 tips that you should know before coming to Thailand so that you can have a better vacation and of course to save money, time and stay away from troubles. Let us start it right now. Now of course the first point that you should know before coming to Thailand is that when is the best season to visit Thailand? When is the rainy season? And of course when is the high season? The first question that comes into your mind when is the best time to visit Thailand? And that matters a lot in order to enjoy your vacation. Now in Thailand there is the high season which is the cool season, the low season which is the rainy season and the dry season which is the hot season. Before I say which are the best months to visit Thailand, let me tell you that the seasons differ slightly depending on which part of Thailand you are visiting, south, west, north or center. But in general, the high season is between November to February, the hot season is between March to May, the rainy season is between June to October. Now when is the best season to visit Thailand? Concerning the weather, of course from mid-November to February. But in my opinion, every season is a nice season to visit Thailand, as long as you are not worried about the weather. As you see, it doesn't matter whenever you come to Thailand, there are high seasons and low seasons. It depends where you are visiting in Thailand and what provinces that you are going to stay. Of course, you are coming to Thailand and there will be lots of adventures and trips. But the question is, should you book them before you arrive to Thailand or you should book them once you arrive to Thailand? The second thing that you might be worried or not sure is to book or not to book the tours that are on your schedule. Many people wonder if they should book their tours online before they travel to Thailand or they can book when they arrive. The answer is so simple. If you are traveling in high season and your time is limited, then you can book online. But if you have plenty of time and it's not high season, then better to book once you arrive because you will get better offers and more choices. My advice to you, if you are tight on a schedule, book the first two trips and book the rest when you arrive. And I am sure you will save a lot. So if it's high season and your time is tight, then book it before you arrive. But of course, if you have lots of time, then to book once you arrive, it's a better idea. Stay in a 5-star hotel if you can, but if you cannot, then let's talk about this point. When it comes to hotels in Thailand, there are as many as you can imagine concerning the prices, the location and the offers. Now the special thing in Thailand is that you can find 5 or 4 star hotels cheaper than sometimes 3 to 2 stars hotels. So before you make any judgment on the prices depending on the stars, check the 5 stars hotel. And I am sure you will find good deals and sometimes book a nice room with beautiful view only for $50 including breakfast. But if you see the offers are not according to your budget, then go for the other options. So always keep in mind, everyone can stay in 5 star hotels in Thailand because the offers are a lot. Now the fourth point to know is what to dress and what to respect before even coming to Thailand. Here we come into something that you should know before visiting Thailand and that is about the culture and tradition. Now we all know that Thailand is a hot country, beautiful destinations, islands and more 
and maybe we have in mind that we can wear anything anywhere we want and do everything that we can and can't back home. This idea is totally wrong concerning what to wear and not always dress properly and accordingly. For example, it's not appropriate to walk on the streets of Bangkok with your swimsuits or wearing shorts, skirts and visiting temples. Moreover, respecting traditions and Thai people beliefs is above all. So keep in mind, be humble and enjoy your vacation. Nowhere to shop and of course when to bargain. This gonna save you a lot of money if you follow the tips. Thailand and especially Bangkok is one of the best shopping destinations in the world. And we are all excited to visit these gigantic shopping malls, weekend markets, night markets. Wherever you look, you will find shopping opportunity, offers, promotions and more. But the question is where to shop and what to shop. It's so important to know from where to buy and from where not. And moreover, where to bargain and where not. Know the malls and the markets, their special items, their offers and prices. And according to that, do your shopping. And moreover, know where to use your bargaining skills and where not. So guys, don't shop in the wrong places and of course don't bargain when you don't have to bargain. Follow these tips and you're gonna save a lot of money. You are the only one responsible for your safety in Thailand. So know what you are riding or what you are doing before you come to Thailand. Coming to Thailand and not going to tours or doing activities is not a complete vacation. Because what will give you joy is those tours and the adventures that you will have at the island, jungle, cities, narrow streets and more. But the only one responsible for your safety while you are doing those activities, adventures and explorations is you. So one advice, if you see that you are not into it or it's more than you can do it, then don't do it. Because once an accident happens to you, then you will be the only one responsible for your actions. So my friends, follow this tip and stay safe because you are here to spend a vacation and of course not to spend it in a hospital. Use the public transportation if you want to explore Bangkok in a faster and a better way. You will save a lot of money and time and avoid most of the scams when you use the public transportation in Thailand. Yes, that's the most important thing to know while you are exploring around, especially Bangkok city. So as a tourist, the most important thing is to use your time wisely. And in Thailand, there are many kinds of transportations like taxis, tuk-tuks, motorbikes, both taxis, buses. So choosing what kind of transportation to use according where you are going will save you a lot of time and money. Moreover, you will avoid most of the scams in Thailand. Don't listen to taxi drivers or take their advices while you are spending your vacation in Bangkok. Well, the worst thing you can do in Thailand while you are exploring around is to ask taxis or tuk-tuks for directions and guided by them. Never ever do that. You will see many of them in the touristic areas, famous landmarks, at the corner of the streets, markets, malls, don't ask them where to go, what to do. And they will approach you most of the time and offer you tours and suggestions. Use the taxis or tuk-tuks only when you know where you are going and how much you should pay. Other than that, they are the worst guides available around, experts to waste your time and money.
eat street food and of course try fruits. You are in Thailand, don't be shy and always try new things. Many visit Thailand and in their mind a question, should we eat street food or not? And once they are wandering around, they see the street vendors, the smells, the crowds, and they are worried if they should try and eat. The answer is yes, don't overthink. Those are the best food you can try, eat and enjoy while you are in Thailand. They are fresh, clean, cooked daily, and the best around. Most of the food that you eat at the restaurants, especially the Thai food, are not better than the street food. And even, most of the time, not as good as the ones on the streets. So go for it and I am sure you will love it, while having the best and paying the less. This is very important, know how to order food while you are in Thailand because if you want to eat what you want to eat then you have to know how to order food. Here it comes for ordering food in Thailand and especially in the local restaurants and even sometimes at the fast food chains. You should be very clear and specific for what you order and if you like it spicy or not, well done or half done, all these details. Cause most of the time, the waiters are not that good to understand your English, especially in the local restaurants. So try to show the order by the picture or the number, unless you will be eating something you did not order. Know where to party and of course with who to party if you want to enjoy your nights in Thailand. Of course you are in Thailand and nightlife is one of its best parts. We all love to explore the nightlife spots, walking streets, the pubs, the bars and much more. But we also should know where to party and where not. So the options are a lot and they are divided into two categories. Places where you will have fun, party, drink and enjoy good companies and places where you will spend, empty your pocket and get troubles in return. So choose wisely. This one is so important, not every lady is a woman and not every gentleman is a man. Here we come to the last point which is very important. Girl or boy, lady or man. This is Thailand and this is Asia. If you are not familiar with these things, then don't get surprised. And don't point your hands or comments on things you see for the first time. Respect people's choice and be careful to know the difference because you might end up with the wrong gender. So my friends, knowing these 12 simple tips will make your vacation better in Thailand and of course to save money and stay away from troubles. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned and subscribe for more from Live Love Thailand.